the amide ion NH2 minus. Well, we take nitrogen out onto the screen and we're going to bond it to two hydrogen atoms. Nitrogen with two hydrogen atoms. The question is what is the shape of the amide ion using the Lewis structure? Well, each hydrogen must be bonded by a shared pair of electrons in which one of the electrons is provided by the nitrogen and one is provided by the hydrogen. However, nitrogen, if we look at the periodic table, nitrogen appears in group 5. It's got five outer electrons. Here we've only used two outer electrons, so we can put in a pair of electrons, and now there are four. And so there's one more electron from the nitrogen. But the amide ion has got a negative charge, and that means if we bring in the negative charge, that negative charge must come in with another electron. And so that gives pairs up with the electron from the nitrogen. Now this means that overall the structure, the iron, has got one, two, three, four regions of electron density. These four regions of electron density will adopt a tetrahedral shape. And the two hydrogens will be on two prongs of the tetrahedron. We take the electron pairs down, and this is going to leave two lone pairs of electrons. Now, in fact, well, let's swap these around. Let's make this a bonding pair here, and the lone pair here. I'm not going to get this. Whoop, shift that to one side a second and a lone pair of electrons here. Let's bring this back in. So now we can see that then that one lone pair of electrons is going to be over here and one lone pair of electrons down here. So the actual shape of the iron, the HNH bond angle, is going to be based on a bond angle of a tetrahedron. That's going to be based on a bond angle of 109 degrees 28 minutes. But these bonds are going to be squeezed closer together by this pair, these two pairs of electrons. These exert more of a repulsive force on the bonding pairs of electrons than the bonding pair of electrons exert on each other. And in fact, normally there is about a two and a half degree squeeze from each lone pair of electrons. So the bond angle of 109.5 degrees gets squeezed down to about 104.5 degrees for the amide ion.